Hey guys, we're going to do some reverse planks today. It's just going to work your arms a little bit, your lower back, your stomach, your hamstrings, your thighs. It's going to work quite a bit of your body. It's a little bit advanced, so if you have any problems with your wrist, you might want to skip this. We're going to take our hands about a shoulder width apart, point the fingers towards your feet. You want the hands back behind you, arms extended but not locked out. And then we're going to pull the shoulders down and back to keep that chest open and to keep the shoulders away from the ears. From here, we're going to push up onto our hands and to our heels. We're going to point those toes and look down towards your feet. You want to focus on that lower part of your stomach, pull it in really tight, and push those hips straight up to the ceiling. And then we're just going to hold it there. It's a nice deep breath in and out. Keep those shoulders down, stomach in tight. And just push up through the heels, through the arms. Make sure the arms are not locked out. We'll hold that just a little bit longer. Good. Let's go ahead and bring it down. Good. Now we're going to add some movement with that. We're going to do the same thing. We're going to take the hands back behind us, shoulder width apart, point the fingers towards the feet. Point those toes. Now we're going to take a deep breath in, pull the shoulders down, deep breath in, and then as you exhale, push the hips up, inhale, bring them down just above the ground, exhale up, inhale down, exhale up, inhale down. Now all the movement here is in the hips. Arms are extended but not locked out and they don't bend. Just move up and down from the hips, stomach in nice and tight. Exhale as you push up, inhale down. Here's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and relax. Come on down, shake the arms out just a little bit, come into a forward bend, stretch out those hamstrings. You're gonna get quite a bit of work there through this. Good, shake the legs out a little bit. 